I had a viral stomach flu two and a half weeks ago. Nausea, fever, aches, no appetite, severe belching, distension of abdomen. After eating again, light easy foods, still lots of belching, bloating, discomfort and now light brown slash beige colored stools, sometimes quite loose. I am feeling okay otherwise. I had hepatitis A as a small child, about 40 years ago. Hello, thank you for your question. You most likely have a viral gastroenteritis, which is a viral infection, most often caused by norovirus in adults, of the stomach and intestines. This may cause nausea, vomiting, and an upset stomach. It may also cause lower abdominal cramps and diarrhea. Viral infections of the G. I. Tract will usually resolve within 48 to 72 hours, however some infections may last up to one week. It is most important during this illness that you maintain hydration. You must drink plenty of fluids. Clear fluids such as clear juices, the syrup juice from canned fruit, or electrolyte drinks, e. Gatorade, are best. Also jello and broth may be taken. Do this until you stop vomiting. If you are hungry then you may eat toast, plain rice, or crackers. Then you may progress to the brat diet, banana, rice, applesauce, toast. To treat the nausea and vomiting or upset stomach you may ask your doctor for compazine. For diarrhea you may take over-the-counter Imodium or Lomodal as long as no toxin or bacterial infection is suspected. If your symptoms persist for longer than a week or if you develop high fevers or have bloody diarrhea you must see your doctor immediately. While you are sick try to maintain good hygiene with careful hand washing and not sharing your personal items with others as this is how this infection is spread. I hope you feel better. I had no vomiting or diarrhea during this illness, though the intense stomach ache and nausea and aches and fever subsided after about 72 hours. No response addressing my first concern about the light beige colored stools or heavy belching which has persisted now for three weeks. The light colored stools are secondary to the rapid transit through the colon or something you have eaten. Unlikely this is related to liver disease. The belching would go along with the gastritis. You may need to have your gallbladder checked also. Try this for belching, when a person has excess gas causing him to belch and pass excessive flatus the majority of the gas comes from swallowed air. Some amount of gas is produced by bacteria acting upon the food that you eat. With that in mind it is important to try to limit the amount of air that you take into your system. It is important to eat slowly and not gulp down your food. It also is helpful to not drink with meals and wait for 10 or 15 minutes until after you finish eating. Drinking tends to introduce air into the stomach. Also it is important to avoid carbonated beverages and also certain foods that tend to form gas such as beans, broccoli, and cabbage. Over-the-counter anti-gas preparations are helpful in breaking up large pockets or bubbles of gas and forming smaller ones making the gas easier to expel. Try to obtain products that have some ethicone in them and take as directed. Something that is not proven but may be helpful is to take probiotic drinks such as Activia. I hope this advice helps you. If you have a health question and want to chat with a doctor now, visit justanswer.com slash yt health.